Good morning guys and welcome back to another video. So, oh my god, look at my hair, I need to wash it. So today, I'm just going to spend the day with me. Um, I got back from Ibiza on Monday, was it Monday? Yeah, Monday night. And since then, the weather has just been shocking. Yeah, it's absolutely pissing it down outside today. So depressing. I was in my beef on Monday, Sunday, being <laughs> what is happening? Where's our summer gone? I mean, it's storm. Oh, I can't remember what it's called. It'd be in an Anthem? Maybe? I don't know. But anyway, yeah, it's going to be raining like this for the next two weeks, I think. So that sucks. But it's Saturday morning. It is 8 o'clock. I'm just having my beanies coffee, as usual. And then. Um, I'm gonna, I was going to the gym but I've got some gym anxiety, anxiety this morning, I don't know why. I haven't been for like a week and a half so it's like, who am I anxious to go back into the gym on your own? I really need a gym buddy. But I don't have one. But it's fine, it's fine. I'm going to go back on Monday but I'm going to go on my tread pad now for an hour. And then I'm going to make some breakfast and I'm going to go and see my friend. I might do the food shop today, I'm going to cook a really nice curry. Uh, we're going to fill some content today. It's going to be quite a chill kind of day because I um, can't really go out and do much. But I think we've got a amber wind warning where I am. So yeah, I don't really want to be driving around too much on that because you know your car just goes like, in the wind, especially on the motorway. It's actually quite scary. And also, my um, when my when I go over 70, well, not over, at 70, my um, steering wheel starts shaking, so I think my wheels need balancing on my car. So I really need to get that sorted at some point. But yeah, that's also quite scary on the motorway. So wind and a shaking steering wheel, not what you want. But yeah, let's drink my coffee. I think I'm going to do an hour on my tread pad. I just want to get my steps up. Yesterday I needed 5,000. It wasn't feeling too great yesterday. I'm getting a cold from holiday. But I'm feeling a bit better today, which is good. So I want to get good amount of steps in. I try and aim for like six or seven thousand this morning and then I think later on this evening it's actually going to stop raining so to take uh, dogs off for a nice long dog walk. I should hit my 10k. That is the plan for today. I should go to the gym really but you know some days you just don't feel like it. It's just one of those days today but hey I'm going to get back to it on Monday. I get my plan in my fall sessions a week and just get back on track because at the end of the month it's my birthday so yeah make a good routine and then I don't want to do this work it's going to take you along with me it's going to be quite fun and I'm obviously going away to Madrid as well another holiday woohoo right let me show you my tread pad and let's get this day going right so this is a little tread pad that I use and it's really small, it just fits in there nicely. And you just go walking on it, obviously it turns on, you just plug it in. Um, obviously it doesn't do any incline or anything, but it's just nice to, I'm gonna put some trainers on because it does hurt your feet. But that's where I got it from. I think I had it for about two years now and it's still really, really good. But I like to do an hour on that. I can watch on YouTube, drink my coffee and we'll make some breakfast. So yeah, it's a really good, um, way to get your steps in it's not too big you do need it on um you can't have it on carpet because it does get very hot but yeah it's a good way to get your steps in especially if it's raining and you don't want to get wet but yeah this will be me for an hour and i'll catch you for breakfast an hour boiling let's go make some breakfast <laughs>
Breakfast is served. I need to really have better eating area. Right, breakfast is served. It's quite late actually. It's 9 40. So I've just got two eggs, some spinach, and some turkey bacon. So I've done. I'm doing 6,000 steps. I thought I did more than that. It's a bit weird. I did like 5.5 speed. I don't know, maybe I was just went too, a bit too slow. But yeah, I'd love spinach. I thought I'd mix it up and have some spinach and some bread today. And um, yeah, the egg is a tiny bit runny, which is always, always good. Obviously, ketchup. Good as always. Right, I'm just gonna get eat this, get in the bath, and then I will quickly do my nails and quickly get ready. And I'll just probably time lapse all of that, and then we can go out. I need to go. I need to do a food shop today, and I want to go into Home Bargains and see what bargains they've got. I just need to pick up some dog food. I thought I might as well do my weekly shop today because the weather's so crap. And it will cool some time. I'm um, hoping I have a movie night tonight. There's me Resident Evil on the watch, so yeah. And also a dog walk. Let's just hope this storm does one, to be honest. I think tomorrow's meant to be alright. But hopefully this evening's alright anyway. Catch you. Catch you later. Right guys. Bath complete, top wash done, and now we're gonna move on to some gel now. So I think we're going for a pink. And I'll just time lapse the process. Yeah, it only took about 15 minutes, but that's that done. I'm always sure the left hand, right hand. What am I on about? I'm always sure the right hand because I'm. What? Yeah. No. Yeah. Whatever. I don't know. Don't know what I'm on about. But I'm gonna get ready off camera and I'm gonna show you uh, my hair and makeup. I just finished doing my makeup, I've only gone for like something casual, but look how long my eyelashes are, 
as all my own eyelashes. I could do with that thing that curls them up. But look how long they are. Wow. I'm just only using the Max Stack mascara. Can't believe how long they are. It's crazy. They look like false lashes. Maybe I should get a lash lift. Wow. That mascara is so good. I do rate it. I've only got like the mini one, but I need to get a big one because it's only running out. But I just can't believe how long they look. They look like fake lashes. Ooh. Right. Let's go do my hair, get dressed, and then we go out. Right, so this is the makeup and hair of today. I've just gone for pretty natural because it's raining and I can't get asked. I'm just gonna have a pretty chill day today. But yeah, I'm quite like my hair like that. I think I need to put a bit of like clippings up here so it's like a bit more volume at the front. I have actually got some, but I just need to like chop them up and make them into proper decent clippings. But yeah. That is what I look like today, I'll show you my outfit. So I've just got some leopard print leggings on. And I'm just gonna match that with, I'm just gonna match it with a black jumper and some pink DMs. Fit of the day guys, I love leopard print as you know. Yeah, it's actually sunny out now, what the hell? It's meant to be raining all day, storm, I can't remember what it's called. Right, I am in the car and we are ready to go. I've got the dog with me. Hello, say hello, bear. Wow, it's really hot now. My jumper smells doggy, which is even better. I'm tired now. I'm in a pissy mood because I'm tired. I think I need to go to the doctor's because I'm tired all the time. I, I thought a nice hour's walk would, you know despite my energy and a nice healthy breakfast haven't been boozing or anything i don't know i just get spells where i'm just so so tired but i might yeah i think i'm gonna go get a blood test done and see what happens but fingers crossed it's nothing too bad but yeah it just happens and i just feel like i can't do anything and it just puts me in a bad mood but Oh no, it's really hot. But yeah, let's get going. Let's go see my mate and let's go do some shopping. I might have a monster. I hope that will perk me up. Just a bit of a caffeine move. I've had, I have had four coffees today though. So yeah, but yeah, wish me luck. Let's go. Ah. Oh. the dog. <laughs> Hello. Mr. Bumhole breath breathing. <laughs> Hello, Bumhole breath. Ah, oh, the dog man. Come here, baby. Oh, you're going. Right, guys, we've just been to Home Bargains and it's pissing it down. I just straightened my hands. <laughs> right, so I've got some dog food and you know what I got? A monster. And dog food for me. <laughs> Yeah, that's your um, week's meal. Classic terrine. And I'm going to do my shopping in Lidl. I'm going to get some turkey bee in Tesco. It's absolutely pissing it down, man. Oh, what is... It's August now, yeah? How? Why? How and why? I know. But yeah, um, I want to make us a yellow Thai curry tonight, but I don't reckon we're going to find yellow Thai paste. I swear makeup keeps running off my... I got burnt on my nose on no Ibiza. Anyway, yeah, I don't know where we'd get yellow, yellow, yellow Kai, yellow Thai curry paste. I can, I, blah, 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 blah. I can Tesco, I'll be the one. I know you can get it on Ocado, that online supermarket, but like we ain't gonna do that, are we? But if not, I'll just make us a red, because that red tie I had no Ibiza was banging. But the yellow's like a bit different. I've never had a yellow one before, but well, I have now. But yeah, let's go do these bits. I don't know what I'm going to do this afternoon. I'm supposed to film a haul, but I might wait till tomorrow because I'm just tired. Oh yeah, just with a yellow type, curry tie paste. Ooh, curry tie paste. One star review. <laughs> well, I'm sure they have more, you know. They've got yellow, yellow curry meal kit. I don't reckon Lidl will have it, so we'll just save that for Tesco. But yeah, I'll show you what I buy. It won't be that interesting. It'll just be like a food shop. But yeah, I'll catch you guys when we get home. 
Oh, you can see my nails there now. It only took like 20 minutes. That hand's a bit shit, but. Ooh. My nails. <laughs> Let's go. Right, guys, we is back from the shop. I can't be able to show you what we got because it's not exactly. <coughs> right, guys, I'm back from the shop now. Oh, there's a fruit fly in there. Go away. And I can't actually what I got because it's just sort of groceries and stuff. And I've just shown you loads of times like groceries. But I made this yesterday. It's my take on like one of them poke bowl things. So it's couscous, salmon, coastal, lettuce, olives, uh, spring onion, and some sweet corn and spinach. It was really good yesterday. I just hope it hasn't gone really soggy today. Mmm. Mmm, that's good. It's good. Hey, not my tripod. I literally keeps pissing it down outside and then it's sunny. It's so busy out there. I think everyone's going shopping today. Literally, because there's nothing else to do. But. I got my fuel for the week. I got my food for the week. I'm going to make a turkey a swag bar and that will just do me for bad trip for the week. So that's all good. And now we're just, I think we're just going to chill out the rest of the day. I know I'll do my horse tomorrow because I just can't be fucked today. You know you get those days where you just want to chill. It's a chill day. I love this. It's so good. It's so fresh. I love a bit of curse. Yeah, like since being back from holiday, it's just been so weird. It's been like quite depressing. I think it's just the weather really. And I'm just back to normality, but... So next coming weeks, I'm going to see some friends that I haven't seen for like, since school. So that's a long time because I'm old, eh? Uh, and then, then it's my birthday. So I'm going to go out in Bristol for that and celebrate that. So that would be good fun. And then, a week after that, I'm going to Madrid. Woo! I've never been before, I can't wait. It's been a fourth holiday. How the hell have I afford a fourth holiday? I have no idea. But we have managed it. Even dropping a day at work, so good good management. I love a good olive. Mmm, olivey. But yeah, update on the curry situation. Could not find yellow Thai curry paste anywhere. So Tesco website lied. It's probably it went out probably because it was a one percent star. So no one was probably buying it. So we went for red. And I will make that later and I will show you. We're gonna have some sticky rice a bit. He's gonna show me how to do sticky rice. Easy. Mmm. Dogs are doing their bumming activities as usual. Barry's being angry and growling. Mm-hmm. Mm. If you hear that, it's Barry. Let's try to use salmon. Mm. I love salmon. Nice big bit of salmon. Not too fishy. This is lime and coriander. Right. Enough of me waffling on about shit. Um, I will probably catch you for dinner because I literally am just going to stay in. I think I'm going to watch Resident Evil. I'm like, I'll give you my opinions on that actually. Not if you care. Not if you care. Even if you don't care, I'll just skip. <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> Loud! Right guys, so for dinner I just picked up this red Thai curry. As I said, I really wanted the yellow one, but there was none. So I'm going to put this in a dish with some chicken and then put it in the oven for an hour. And then we're going to sort up the sticky rice and I'll show you what it looks like when it's done. Yay! Our Thai is ready. It's a little bit watery. We need to do the taste test. Mm. Yeah, it's, the sauce is a bit saucy. It didn't, I don't know. We what? left it in the oven for an hour. Hour and 10 minutes. Let's try I think sticky rice. Maybe because it's mm, sticky. It is sticky. But it'll trick work then. It's nice. Yeah, I'd eat it. Have you ever had red Thai before? Yeah. You have? Mm hmm Obviously it's not as good as the one on my beef there. 
I'll just yellow one. I had the red and the yellow. Oh, did you? I did. I only saw the red, the yellow on your on your, on your, on your pube tube. Hot. Ooh. How's the chicken? Is the chicken okay? Mm -hmm. Oh no. I don't know why really. it's so watery though. I think maybe because it was cooked with the chicken. We didn't fry the chicken breast first. Yeah, we just put it in like um, it's it, like little casserole, really, wasn't it? Mm. Usually you do it on the top of the stove, but it's but it is very nice. The rice is sticky. It's a good trick. Bear, bear, move. Freaking dog's knocking over my tripod. Bear. <laughs> yeah, this is what it looks like. It tastes very good. Mm. You can see my face. Ooh. It's getting dark so early, you guys. It's like really bad. Winter's creeping back up, isn't it? I know. It's only like the start of August. It's such a shame. Mmm. Very nice. I've never made sticky rice before, but yeah, this is definitely sticky rice. It's quite spicy, actually. The one I had my beef wasn't too spicy. A little, I suppose, a little bit of a kick. So yeah, we um, we're sharing a bottle of Jummy Red Roux at the dinner because you've got to Saturday night. It's just quite nice and chill. Just a chilled, chilled day to be honest. And um, we watched what was that? The Seven Gates that we watched earlier. Uh, the Nine Gates. The Nine Gates, sorry. It was about the Nine Gates of something, of hell or something. We watched The Nine Gates earlier, which is like a film from 1999. It was actually really good. I quite like my 90s films. <clears throat> they're like so bad that they're really good. But maybe it's because we're from the 90s. <laughs> 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 Who knows? But yeah, I actually quite enjoyed that. And now we're just watching some YouTube. But um, I'm going to finish this. <sighs> Do you like it? It's okay. It's that I've got some cuts and cuts inside in from from, um, from my mouth from eating crunchy food the other day, so it's burning the inside of my mouth really badly. Oh dear! It's still like medium heat. Hmm. Yeah, it's got it's got it has got a little bit of a kick to it, hasn't it? Yeah, it definitely has. Probably should have done it on the top of a stove, but it's still good. It's still enjoyable. I'll eat it. I'll be safe. Mm. I feel like the chicken's absorbed more of the flavour this yeah. way. Definitely. And it hasn't dried it out. I'd rather have a nicer, moister meat than like a dry meat. Because when, when I've made curries before, and I've done it on in the pan, the chicken tasted a little bit bitey and a bit dry. Yeah. Pro tip, guys. If you want to make a really good curry, you need to put it in like a casserole dish for an hour in the sauce, and it just comes out really juicy, doesn't it? Yeah, at like, put it at like 160, so it's not too high. It just, it's, you know, it's, it's a nice slow burner. Mm. I just dribbled on my own legs. If you've got time, obviously, yeah, definitely do that. Mm. It just makes the meat so much more tender. It absorbs the flavour. Also, guys, Muscle Foods chicken. It's really good. Oh, that's very nice. Really, really good. Much better quality than, like, Lidl's or You don't Tesco's. get that, like, grizzly fineness of it. Mm. <laughs> Although that one time you had that piece of bone in it, which is a bit gross. But it's gonna happen, I suppose, isn't it? Every now and again. It's like when you buy fish, you still you get like the little bits of bone in the fish and things like that. You just gotta to think about it once it happens, isn't it? I've had I've had a bit of bone this in. This is really bitey. This um, red thyme. I think as well, when you cook it a little bit longer, it makes it it enhances the heat a bit because it's given that 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 given that that flavour more time to. It is very very nice though. Yeah, that rice is good too. It's such an easy meal to cook as well. Just mm. like literally whack it in the oven for an hour and let the rice sit for 15 minutes in water and then whack that on and then there you go. Put the two and two together, there's your meal. Oh, excuse me, I've been eating too quickly. I'm starting to burp. I love curries though. They're my favourite food. Definitely. Don't have to hide it very often, but definitely need to. Mm. Yeah, guys, we managed to we, we watched that film and then we've taken the dogs out. Now we're gonna watch the new Resident Evil. Mm. So instead of boring you with my eating chat, I'll probably just end this video here. 
Um, I'll let you know about the Resident Evil in another vlog. So there's been so many now. How many is this one? Like the tenth or something? I thought they were stopping them, but obviously not. I hope it's got Alice in it, like the main lady. Has it? Do you know? What? You know Alice in Resident Evil? No idea. The main character. I know, I know who the woman is. I have no idea if she's in it. Mm. Let me Google it. Google her. But yeah, thank you for spending the day with me. I know it's not been like the most amazing day to spend with me. <laughs> but the weather's been crap. And you know, we all get days where we just like to chill out, you know, doing a bit of shopping, doing a bit of self care this morning. And now I'm just watching films and eating nice food. So, all good in my opinion. You just need those days. Yeah, so thank you so much for watching. Please like, please subscribe, and I will catch you in my next one.